Welcome everybody to this JMC Week webinar. It's September 20th, 2023. It's Ways We Support. My name is Paul Freed. I'm a trainer here at JMC. I've been with JMC for 18 years. Um, and I love visiting schools. I live on a small farm in southeastern Minnesota. It's a beautiful, beautiful day here. You can see a, my goat and a couple of llamas out my back door. And uh, yeah, so lots of great things going on. I've got two wonderful ladies with me. I've got Sherry Phillips. So Sherry, why don't you introduce yourself? Hey, thank you, Paul. Yes, Sherry Phillips. I am actually not near Paul. I'm actually in Racine, Wisconsin. Um, and it's a beautiful day here too, Paul. Um, my background is worked several years in a JMC office and I love JMC and now I'm helping train folks just like Paul and Denise. Happy to be here. And Denise, why don't you tell us about yourself? All right, I'm Denise Drew and I've been with JMC for about a year. And prior to that, I worked with JMC for close to 25 years at Lanesboro School in the office. So I was an office professional and I'm super happy to be here with the rest of you today going through ways we support. You probably got the three most positive people at JMC on the line right now, don't you guys think? I mean, we are, we are the, we're the bubbly, the bubbly trio of JMC, so here we go. There is so um, much sunshine, you might need sunglasses for this. That's video. right. All right. The backbone of any great software support. At JMC, we offer support that's available on your schedule. We know that the questions you have and the issues you face will vary. So we've made sure we deliver support how you want it, when you need it, and it's always free. And this is important to us. And I tell folks very honestly, we care about schools. We want you to do well. And when you need your questions answered, we do our best to answer them in a timely manner. Here are the support topics we're going to cover today. Up-to-date training in a variety of formats, unlimited access to tech specialists, on-demand support tools and dedicated support. Before you go on there, Denise, I'll say, Sherry, I think maybe we'll just kind of flip-flop a little bit on um, some of the reading. Is that okay with you? Absolutely. Great. So let's get going first on up-to-date training in a variety of formats to meet your needs. All right. Now, before I even start reading this, I want to tell you that our, our you'll see us talk about our training is free, our, our uh, our support is free. And, and even though we tell schools all the time, we'll still go to schools. Um, I was out of school two months ago and I walked in and there was like, hey, I was going, well, I'm new. I couldn't get any training. You can always get trained. We've got, and we're going to go through it all today. So stress this to your team. If they've got a question, they need some training, reach out to us. All right. Our software is continually updated. So is our free training. When we release a new feature module or update, we don't leave you in the own to figure it out. We ensure our training is up to date for all our 400 plus features and you won't pay an extra cent to access it. If you learn, you know, here's the, the different items that we have here. If you learn best face-to-face -face virtually or in the middle of the night, we've got you covered. Now, not only am I going to tell you the options here, but I'm going to add my ideas as a person who really has been doing training for 18 years. So let's hit it, Denise. The first option is you can come to us. JMC offers in-person training opportunities during our annual summer conference and at regional conferences held throughout the year. You also could come to Lake City, Minnesota if you want to as well. It does happen. Um, really important that you send at least a couple of people from each building to our JMC summer conferences. Next, we can come to you. Schools have the option to schedule training sessions with our dedicated JMC trainers who are conveniently located across the Midwest. If you're interested in on-campus training, please don't hesitate to reach out to us at training at jmcinc.com for more information. I will tell people that um, uh, a lot of schools think that in-person training with a trainer is the most efficient. It is not. Uh, we don't do a ton of it. And the reason is if somebody needs training today, and they say, hey, we want to set up training for our, our new teachers in you know three, feet, three weeks or six weeks or whatever. I say, let's set up training next week. Have them watch this video and let's do a one-on-one -on -one Q and A session with the, the Google Meets. It's so efficient. So we don't do a lot of in-person trainings anymore because we have so many tools in the toolbox that we didn't even have 10 years ago. But if, if it's imperative or there's something that would need to necessitate that, you know, sometimes last year I had a school that had a total changeover mid-year of their administrative and office team. Yeah, we'll come there and try to help you through that. But we're still going to do some videos and trainings beforehand as well. Next, let's meet virtually. This is how we do 99% of our training. If you like the benefits of in-person training but want to or need it virtually, we have it covered too. Google Meets, it's one-on-one -on -one, one -on -one virtual meetings with JMC trainers that are scheduled at a time and date that works best for you. We do these all the time. Sherry does them, I do them, Denise does them. It's, it literally is like having somebody there with you. We learned that during COVID, right? You can be looking at the same screen of a person and get that, that training you need 
pretty, pretty much pro sometimes even within 24 hours, even less if you need that training. And we also have these weekly webinars. JMC's free interactive webinars include demonstrations of new features, overviews of little known features, and training sessions to help new users get up to speed with the software. Fun fact, JMC's weekly webinars are recorded. Can't make it? No problem. Register and a recording will be emailed to you. And we tell this to people all the time. If 1230 on Wednesdays doesn't work for you, register and buy Typically Thursday later in the day, if not earlier, we'll email you a recording of the presentation. Then we have that 24 seven on training on demand. If you prefer flexibility in your training schedule or enjoy self-paced learning, we have an extensive library of video tutorials available. These videos provide step-by-step -step guidance on practical applications of JMC software. You can explore our, J our JMC channel playlists, which offer video collections tailored to various audiences, including office professionals, teachers, and new users. Whether you're new to our software or transitioning from a different product, you'll find video tutorials that address your specific learning needs. Now, actually, let's go back to that other one there too. I'm not going to necessarily take a live look because these are more discussion items. But I want to point out one other thing that um, Sherry is really good at pointing out is that with each of these videos, there is a um, there is a description. Um, Denise, are you able to bring up uh, YouTube? Is that okay? Yeah, there we go. So click on anyone there. There's a tense formula. Why don't you just pause it there? So there we go. Scroll down a little bit, and it's imperative to know that if you click on the more right there, that's right, Denise we have a link to the slides that we're presenting. So for this presentation, we've got them, or for that one too. If you wanna follow along, send it to somebody, print it out, PDF it is right there. And that is so helpful to have for you. In case you wanna go back and watch a video, you can see that. Then also in the description, we typically have a listing of the timestamps so you can go right to an item. So you wanna see how to create an attendance letters, go ahead and click on that one there. Yep, click on that and it will take you right to that one right there. There it is, yep. So those two tools help you efficiently move through um, the JMC trains. And the nice thing about the videos, you can watch them when you want, and you can watch them at your own pace, and you can back them up, right? So that's really helpful. So Sherry, anything else you wanna add or did I cover that enough for those, the videos there? Cause I know it's, it's something you're really passionate about. It is, and you did a great job. And just like you said, I'll, um, the more button, that's the thing that I don't want people to miss. Absolutely, thank you. Yep. And how do you find these trainings? You can go here to our training opportunities on the main screen of the JMC office page. I always tell people, if it's on there, it's important. Take a minute every few weeks to just review what those are. And that's where you can sign up for those. So great. Thanks, Denise. Yep, you can sign up really easily and log in and you're good to go. All right. Let's go back to the presentation. Does that sound good, Denise? Oh, you're, you're fancy there. All right, keep on rolling. Sherry, do you want to take this next part? Absolutely, unlimited access to JMC's tech specialists. Our tech specialists are humans. When you need to talk to a tech specialist, you don't have time to select from menus and repeat your question to different, in different ways until the chat box understands. When you reach out to a JMC tech specialist, you get a person every time at no extra cost. It's tech support that's complimentary, not complicated. And here I love that. Our favorite. <laughs> Here's our favorite Joe, too, by the way. That's right. That is yeah, Joe. Let's take a pause. That is Joe. Yes. <laughs> That's right. Everybody loves Joe. <laughs> our tech specialists value your time. And here, there's Paul, too, right there. Our team prides itself on getting back to all of our users in less than 24 hours, usually within minutes. If a team member can't answer your question, we'll connect with you We'll connect you with someone who can. We'll also brief them on the issue before you talk so that they're ready to jump right in and you don't have to explain your problem again, which is really helpful. You know, you explain it for five minutes and you, do, you, know, you don't wanna start over. Um, yeah, thanks, next slide. Thank you. Our tech specialists are local and experienced. Our tech support team is made up from folks based in Lake City, Minnesota. Some have been with us from the beginning, like 40 plus years, and they all have at least 20 years of experience helping schools succeed with the software. Our tech specialists are available to all, always for free. Users in your district can contact us at the 800 number, 800-524-8182, extension one, or email training, which is training at jmcinc.com, or tech support, um, which is support at jmcinc.com, or they can use our in-app widget for all their questions. That offer is good for the lifetime of your relationship with us at JMC. Um, and yeah, did we mention this is all free? I think schools don't realize that. Yep. 
Three tips to ensure a successful resolution. Number one, provide a clear and detailed description. Begin with a clear and concise description, incorporating essential details such as the error message, an error code, screenshots to assist tech support in diagnosing and resolving the problem efficiency. Screenshots are gold. Explain the steps taken, that's number two. Briefly outline the steps you've already taken to troubleshoot the issue. This helps tech support avoid suggesting solutions that you've already tried, that's helpful. And finally, number three, specify the impact. Mention any deadlines or time sensitive aspects related to the problem. This information helps tech support prioritize your issue. Yep, if it's an emergency, we would like to know. So um, can I add in there? Can you go back Absolutely. to that slide? Or is that Absolutely. right? You know, <clears throat> we in general we tell people a few things that um, we haven't talked about the in-app widget. We will in just a moment here, but um, the in-app widget is great for just short, quick questions that you, you need answers to. I actually asked our, both of our summer conferences, "What's the longest somebody waited to get an answer?" Or somebody actually to reply in that in-app widget. Nobody waited longer than fifteen minutes the whole year. That's amazing. Number two, if you need to talk to somebody, call the one eight hundred number. If you need to, if you have a, an error report or something that you need to like share a screenshot, send an email to support at jmcinds.com. So even if you call support and say, hey, I've got this error with this kid, we're going to say, hey, email us the error report, the full error report. Don't block out kids' names. Don't block out any of their identifying information because we won't need to see that information to help you identify why you're getting that error. So in a nutshell, quick questions, use the widget. Need to talk to somebody, you know, about, you know, questions that you have, a live person call the 1-800 number. If you've got a more detailed thing that you need where you're gonna come in and you, you have errors or you wanna show some screenshots or it might be email us, yep, they got it right in the top right corner there, support at jmcinc.com. Yep, so that's all that we need right there. So great, we can go back to the, um, the presentation there. Thanks, Denise. And then the, I'll go to the on-demand. The other thing is just communicate clearly. That's what that slide's meant to see. You know, we still get phone calls. Where people say, "Hey, this is uh, this is Don, and I need you to give me a call back." Click. You know, like no school name, no phone number. You know those things. And so we kind of chuckle about that. But we want to get back to you quickly, so leave that. Yeah, we don't have caller right. ID. There is no caller ID. I think people That's get right. that. So, yep. Absolutely. Great, on-demand support tools. On-demand support tools for quick answers. For the times when your questions don't require a tech specialist but do require a quick answer, you can turn to our widget. Help center articles, video tutorials, and our system status page for free. Our in-app widget allows users to search for the right answers the first time exactly when they need them. It also provides users with direct access to technical support with the click of a button, available at all times and always at no extra cost. Our help center, is a robust collection of over 800 how-to articles on common JMC tasks. And I will tell you, this, this help center is something that our team is working on all the time. And you can go in there and you can search and you can find on a variety of topics. And, and Sherry Phillips is also good at this and Denise too. Sometimes people have questions. We don't have to type up all the, the steps to the answer. We'll send you the help center article. Any user can visit anytime by clicking the visit help center right, link right inside the in-app help widget. Our system status page keeps you in the know. JMC status page located on the bottom of our JMC website, which is jmcinds.com, will inform you about outages and scheduled maintenances. Check anytime to view current statuses for all JMC applications and modules. We are up over 99% of the time. It's, uh, I don't think we've had to do anything with that page very, very, at least in the last year, if not multiple years, because we're always up and running. So I want to go to the, the the widget real quick, Denise, and you you're a person that helps to manage the widget there as well. Yep. So Denise, do you want to just tell people like how people use the widget, or do you want me to? Go ahead. Great. So you can first of all, we always encourage people to visit that help center there or search for help. The cool thing about searching for help in there, if you go, let's do, um, let's go search for help. Yep, and let's click um, uh, email report cards. Why don't you type in email report cards? The cool thing is that, and then you hit return. It'll bring up those items right there here, printed email report cards. You can click on that. The nice thing is the directions are right inside the program. So you actually have to navigate to the page. You have to find that article and you can go through step one, step two, step three. So that's pretty cool. Um, you go back and click the back arrow button there on the top left of that. There you go. I, because I, I um, that, that's some people really like that. That's not my favorite. I like to visit the help center. So go ahead and click the visit help center. Nope, that back there on the, the top arrow there. There you go. Yeah, the visit help center down. There you go. This opens it up in a new window. I, I just, I, I don't mind toggling back and forth between the article 
and also the, um, the, the, the program itself. So now if I went and I went to email report cards to go search for articles, again, at the top there, it's gonna bring up the same exact list, right? There's nothing different. And you can go ahead and click on that. It's just, for me, it's a little easier to read and it's all right there. So whatever you want to do, you, it, it, either, either one, you can also send this link to users. So if your admin needs some directions or another person, a parent, you can send them the link that listed there as well. Yep, we can just copy and paste that link into an email and you're good to go. Now, if you go it. back- I love it too. Oh, sorry, I love that you can Let's... share. I, I, yes. I love that you can share. These are independent URLs. You can share every article. Um, yeah, I agree with you. I like it a lot. We send those URLs a lot, yep. And then you can click send us a message there. We're not gonna send a message right now, but you'll see it, it, it says we typically reply in 10 minutes. It's up there a little bit, Denise. Nope, I keep going, click on that one again. Nope, you click off that one there. You, that's showing your old messages there. Yep, no, open it back up, there we go. Now click on that messages again. So you're showing the old messages there, there we go. Yep, click that to, to get rid of it or go to the home, sorry, that's what it is. Click the send us a message. It's up in the middle there, up a little bit. There it is, nope, up a little more. That allows you to go ahead and click that. That's how you send a message to us at JMC. Hey, I've got a question or whatever it might be. The cool thing is, and Denise was poking at that a little before, you can see previous messages that were sent. So you got a history in case you wanna look back at something that was a conversation you had a week ago. Also, the way the real world works, and you'll hear me say this pretty frequently if I'm, if I'm doing a training, is that you're interrupted throughout the day. So lots of times people will send us a message and then they, they're checking kids in in the morning and then we'll respond within you know, 10, 15 minutes. And then they'll get, they'll respond again. Oh, what about this? And then we'll respond. So it might be a quick question that only took three or four minutes on your side and three or four minutes on our side, but it might be spread out over a half an hour because you're busy, you're at your desk and you don't have time to dedicate eight minutes to it, but that's okay. We just leave that conversation open. And when you get to it, um, we're there and happy to help you there as well. So it's really helpful. So do you need us to share anything else you want to add about the in-app widget? I like what you said about how it, it retains your messages. I really like yep. that. So you can kind of click it and then, like you said, move on with your day and then check back. And then even the old ones, because some of the stuff we do maybe once, maybe four times a year. And I like that it keeps my, it keeps your notes a little bit. So, yeah. I like it too. And you know me, I like to tell stories, my trains. I got a cell phone for my daughter for college. I'm not a cell phone person, so I, I'm not, I don't, you, but she just got her first cell phone. I know we're, we're basically the Amish family here in Lake City. But anyways, I was, I was using the in-app widget to talk with the person about pricing and they quoted me. I thought they said 30 to $35 a month. And, but then they, at the end, they're like, oh, it's $50. They're like, no, you quoted me 30 to $35. And they said, oh yeah, that's what it is. And so on. Well, I got my bill the last few months. and It was more than expected. So I went into the in-app widget. And I'm like, I'm going to check and see on their program. I'm not going to say who it is on their program. I'm going to say, see if I can see my previous messages. And I could not. And I messaged them and said, hey, in my previous message, they quoted me this price, I think, but I don't remember for certain. And they started saying, yep, I'm reading your message. This is what it says. And so we kind of went back and forth. I said, can you send me the message? And they said, no, we can't. That was frustrating. Because <laughs> I'm like, you have it in front of you. You could send it to me, but you're not. And I still have not resolved that. So I love that you can see the previous messages that we have there. So, all right, I digress. Let's get back to our presentation here. It just shows that ha having access to that is really helpful. So any questions that have, folks have come in? Think about a smaller crowd today. This is always a topic that is not super popular because it's not feature specific, but we do send this to a lot of our schools to help them to know how we can help them. So let's keep on rolling. And I think there's one more section. Do you want to take this one, uh, Sherry? Sure, absolutely. Dedicated support. Each school is assigned a complimentary CSS. Our client service specialist, we call CSS team is comprised of principals, office folks like Denise and I, and superintendents who have a passion for helping users get the most out of their software. Reach out to our CSS for tech support questions to facilitate training opportunities or any help you need with JMC. You guessed it, there is no additional cost for reaching out to your CSS. Your CSS will check on you. Your client service specialist adds a personal touch, checking in on you from time to time just to see how everything is going. Your CSS will also share up, upcoming opportunities and other exciting JMC happenings to keep you in the know and the cost. Yep, that's free too. Free, free, free. We are looking for a few JMC superstars. At almost every school, we find an unofficial JMC go-to person. This is the person colleagues 
contact if they have a quick question about a module. You may hear them sharing JMC tips and tricks with a colleague over lunch. When a JMC training comes up, they're the ones that are nominated to go for your school. Sound like someone you know, maybe it's you. Whoever it is, whoever came to mind, we want to meet them. Why? Because we've learned along the way that these JMC superstars make the best client service specialists. And we're looking for a few part-time passionate client service specialists. Apply today with your resume and cover letter, cover letter to hr at jmcinc.com. And that's what um, Denise and I are. I'm in Wisconsin in my area. Denise is in her area in Iowa. So. Yep, and I also cover some in Minnesota as well, but we got yes, folks all over the Midwest. So yes. got some great all, new folks. All does in all the other ones. <laughs> Yeah, so that, that's right. Everybody else. No, I'm just kidding. That's right. <laughs> well, I think that's it. You know, again, I want to start where I, I, I want to finish where we started is there's no cost. We want you to be trained. The tra more trained you are, the happier you are, the less stressed you are, and the less actually you, you reach out to JMC for tech support and training. So we try to train you fully. Take advantage of the videos. Take advantage of the these webinars. Take advantage of the different support items that we have. There's always somebody here to answer your question. And if you need some training, let us know. We can do a webinar. We, we just remote right into your computer. It's like us being there, training you one-on-one. -on -one. So let's talk about JMC News and upcoming events. We got lots of webinars coming up here. We've got the refresh rollout tomorrow on the features of the new community messenger. I'm excited about that. Then our last week of September, we've got our admin workshop one for new administrators. And we've got some new innovation alert for the teacher summits and Minnesota Star Reporting. And then October week one, we've got the credit checker and the new great acceptance in JMC office. That's an important one because we've got that new process there. October week two, getting ready for the end of term, which that includes the teacher side as well as the office side and summer conference new features review round one. That's one of my favorites as well. All right. Do you have a positive experience with JMC that you'd like to share? We can reference and help us spread the word. Email your district's reference letter to marketing at jmcinc.com and you'll be entered for a chance to win a JMC Pride Kit. Community members will now have an online portal to create their own account and choose the types, email, text, and voice of messages they went to receive, want to receive from the school districts as well as subscribe to specific categories of messages. The module is fully integrated, so schools have a streamlined process and an informed community without third-party software. It's, it's going to be awesome. It looks beautiful. It functions uh, so smooth. Join us to take a closer look at some of the community message center portals on September 21st. That's tomorrow at 1230 by registering there. And have a new superintendent join your district or a principal. How exciting. Have them join us for our new administrator workshop series and cross Learn New SS off their summer to-do list. Sign up today by visiting this article and the full new administrator workshop series lineup. You can stay there for a minute, Denise. You can also go to the Help Center and search new administrator and that article will come up there as well. Another great way to stay up to date on all things JMC is through our social media presence. Follow us at Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn at onlinejmc or our blog, jmcinc.com slash news. On behalf of myself, Sherry, Denise, and the entire training team, thank you for your time today, and thank you for choosing JMC.